Remove inappropriate plants like this spurge by hand with community groups and volunteers. These are non-natives that do not provide shelter or food for wildlife and are toxic to the soils. Along the walking trails, plant local native wetland, transition, and upland plants like these guys. Create and install educational graphics and signage like this. On the former parking lot and grassy lawn, plant shallow water wetland, transition and upland plants. Here at Malibu Lagoon, in this small patch of a wetland meadow, is an ideal place to put two endangered species of plants close to extinction that like to associate with this yellow-flowered salt marsh daisy. And those two endangered plants are the Ventura Marsh Milkfetch and the Salt Marsh Bird's Beak. Plant additional reed beds like these tulies, also cattails and sedges, plants which soak up pollutants and help clean our wetlands naturally. And lastly, create and install platforms that would be about the height of these poles and bring baby bald eagles and osprey that are young birds as chicks and place them on the platforms with a protective cage around them and then feed them daily. These are two birds, the bald eagle and the osprey, that were here at Malibu Lagoon historically. And this program would be to take care of and monitor them as they grow.